biggest moment of pride and uh, uh, and uh, uh, gratitude was when i was given an opportunity to play the role of shiva in a, in the the last in the final grand finale dance of shiva tandava during the sports meet of 1994 i still remember practicing it was in a kuchipudi style there was a you know, one one uh, uh, professional who had come to from hyderabad to train us and you know he had a very beautiful way of uh, of telling bangya shiva bangya kind of a, a thing you know he used to encourage us so much and uh, so here i was practicing shiva tandava and uh, you know learning the nuances of kuchipudi and uh, you know doing that high jump you know very very high you need to make that uh, high uh, jump of shiva tandava you know getting the body language right and all those things it was very very uh, you know powerful experience you know we we had a rehearsal in front of swami you know and we we i was thrilled that i will be getting a chance to dance in front of swami in the purnachandra auditorium uh, it was unbelievable for you know to to think that i will get a chance to present that you know first few steps it was the entire dance had not yet been curated the the first 20 seconds of the dance is all that i had the opportunity to present in front of swami so uh, we we danced and you know there was one step you know in which uh, i was supposed to you know put one foot forward and my hand like this you know i was there was there was a beautiful step put one foot in the front and drag the next 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 foot and then put it in the front and then again drag the foot so that was the step that i did and you know i had i had practiced it well in the Uh, in the institute in the hostel in the college hostel in the uh, hostel dining hall i had practiced it well and uh, i did uh, you know without any th- without any thought i did the same step for uh, in the uh, purnachandra auditorium also it was just 20 25 seconds of uh, dance but extremely vigorous so by the time i finished swami you know beckoned me you know i to- told me to come forward i went closer to him you know panting and I had a full uh, because the dance was so vigorous. I was uh, I was panting there, so I I went and you know uh, stood in front of him. And uh, Swami said, you "No, know, of all the dance, he did not give me any other feedback. He said that, see, don't uh, you know in in this dance, don't drag your feet. You lift your back foot and keep it front. You know the, the master had very clearly told that the beauty of the dance is you know you put the front foot forward and drag the the back foot and then put it forward and drag the right foot and put it forward." it was a very graceful step but swami said don't drag it lift your leg and put it forward lift your leg and put it forward otherwise you know it will start bleeding i was so thrilled with that whole thing yes swami yes swami i was uh, very happy and you know i went and stood in the corner you know still basking in that glory and basking in that in that uh, uh, that moment of you know swami has spoken to me kind of a thing and then swami started looking at the next programs and he was doing uh, as i was looking you know my i felt my toes feeling wet my toes were feeling wet you know i i i was you know, you know wriggling my toes to see what is this wet i could not see much in the in the in the you know because it was shadowy area but then i started it started hurting when i i looked down i saw that all my toes had got skinned right it had it had become wounded because you know in purnachandra the there was some some uh, you know sand and the floor was not very smooth in the hostel it was a nice beautiful floor a uh, very smooth floor so i could do that step beautifully but in purnachandra the floor was rough right and you know what i take away from this whole thing you know is is this thought process that even before my brain could register that my legs are hurt here was bhagwan who has understood that this boy's leg is hurt and is giving me advice with pain with concern is telling me don't do that your your legs legs will hurt and no had i had he not told me there and had i done that step in the uh, in the stadium my whole i think foot would have got uh, like you uh, know like potato ko peel karte hai na it would have वैसे वैसे peeling ho gaya hota right <laughs> so that would have been the experience the whole skin would have come out 